Ladies and gentlemen, unfortunately, we could not welcome you at the Light and Building Fair in Frankfurt in March. But today, I present you our product news and innovations of the Siemens Gamma Instabus. My name is Olaf Kröger and I'm a product manager for the Gamma Instabus system based on the KNX technology. Let's take a look at our panel. I would like to present to you three interesting topics. About two years ago, Siemens began designing and launching a completely new family of thin rail mounted devices. It started with a continuous series of switch actuators. The scaled actuators are available with 4, 8 and 12 switching channels and have module with of 4, 8 and 12. The portfolio is designed for various rated currents from 6 amperes, 10 amperes up to very high currents of 20 amperes. Furthermore, the switching of capacitive, inductive and resistive loads is possible. A wide variety of switching applications can be implemented. At the front of the device, the actuators have a mechanical switch position indicator with manual operation. What all actuators have it in common it is that they have extensive control, override and diagnostic functions. In addition to the existing diagnostic functions, such as counting operation hours and switching cycles, a further serious extension with load current detection has now been launched on the market. The current is recorded and evaluated. The failure of loads, overloads and contact errors can be reported. These special switching actuators with load current detection are also available with 4, 8 or 12 channels. The new generation of rail mounted devices also includes the range of switching dim actuators. These are used to control electronic ballasts of flow sense lamps or to control LED drivers for LEDs. This range is now complete with the 4 and 8 channel versions. Dimming curves and dimming times can be set for optimum dimming behavior. An optimal lighting situation only works in harmony with an innovative solar protection system. For this purpose, the 4 and 8 volt solar protection actuators were introduced. Blinds, door, window or ventilation flaps drives with alternating current motors up to maximum 230 voltage are controlled by them. Particularly noteworthy is that an end position detection for automatic travel time determination can be carried out via current measurement per channel. This is unique on the market. Of course, the consistently proven control and override function are implemented per channel. These are supplemented by numerous status messages. The concept of the safety function is unique. Up to seven override function blocks are available. This can be parameterized individual. Different priorities can be assigned. All these family members presented are united by the uniform appearance. The maintenance-free plug-in terminal technology the manual operating level with status messages on the front of the device, the test contacts below, the plug-in in terminal and the continuous powerful functions concept. The device electronics are always supplied via the KNX bus. Binary inputs and actuators for heating and cooling applications will force complete the family of modular device in the future. Let us now turn on the subject of lighting control with DALI. With the DALI Gateways Plus, Twin and Twin Plus, Siemens offers a coordinated device portfolio. This differs in terms of the number of DALI channels, in terms of functions and properties, and in terms of support 
for other DALI sensors, such as the DALI push button interface. Furthermore, this DALI family was extended by a DALI switch DIM actuator. This overs two channels. Via these channels, up to 20 DALI ECGs can be controlled via DALI broadcast. This DALI family is also equipped with a direct operation level on the front panel and a display. This makes it easy to diagnose and check the installation. The extensive control override diagnostic functions per channel already mentioned for the new generation of DINREL devices are reflected in the DALI application with further special features. As a highlight of this fair, I would like to present the color light control of the DALI actuators. You can now control the color temperature and brightness of the ECGs via device type 8. Here you can see the change of the color temperature and so the change from cold light to warm light. And back. In the same time, we can operate this with our visualization system, with this slider. You can see the change between warm to cold light. With this, I have already named the third FAIR topic. Is it about our powerful visualization controller, the IP control center? This controller has already received an important firmware update to version 4 in January of this year. The IP control center is used for the automation and visualization of small and medium-sized functional buildings and with its up to 1,250 data points, is also ideally suited for upscale residential construction. With the new firmware, version 4, numerous security measures have now been implemented. The device now supports HTTPS connections. Data between the IPI control center and the browser of the display devices are securely transmitted. Each visit of web pages must be authenticated by security certificate. The password protection also meets the high security requirements. The settings on the IP control center are now very clearly arranged. The controller has been given a central configuration page for this purpose. All relevant settings are now made in one place. Furthermore, the timer module was extended by a presence simulation. The setting of a random temporal variance around a parameterized time switch point is possible. The HTML views for the timer program and the scene control have been specially optimized for a smartphone display as well as on a desktop PC. Scenes can now even be configured by the end user directly via the few pages. The alarm management has been extended and optimized with messages for alarm status and alarm acknowledgement. The project engineer or the system integrator is now supported by a clearly arranged module for complete data management. A central tabular view provides an overview for the group addresses and communication objects. The project engineer, the system integrator, is now supported by a clearly arranged module for complete data management. The central table of view provides an overview for the group addresses and communication objects at any time. This can now be clearly filtered and managed using categories, functions, or even building parts such as rooms, floors, and so on. A new module offers the possibility to control Sonos loudspeakers directly via KNX. This opens up new audio applications. Another new module offers the possibility of intelligent lighting control via smartphone or tablet by controlling the Philips Hue LED lighting system. Ladies and gentlemen, I hope you enjoyed 
our virtual fair and above all. I hope it inspired you to learn more about the Siemens KNX product range. Our extensive range of courses on KNX and our devices can be found at following link. We also offer comprehensive web-based training for a better understanding of our products with this link. For promotional information, please visit our webpage with this link. For more technical questions, technical documentation, machining tool, tender text and much more, please use our webpage site GammaTD with following link. Thank you very much. Thank you.